Hello everybody and welcome back to three scary games. I got I got I got some good ones today. I think they, they looked good. I don't know if they're going to be. That's why we play it to find out. If you want to watch us play it live and say hello and be in the YouTube video like the cuties underneath me, make sure to click the link in my description. It's going to take over my Twitch page where we record these live every single day. Without yapping, without talking too much, let's jump into the first game called Creepy Waves FM. No, I think it's called Train Depart. Yeah, Train Depart. It's about a game. It's about a story about a kid on a train by himself. If that doesn't sound scary, you haven't experienced it because it's fucking frightening. Oh my God, I cursed. I have to edit that now. Damn it. Uh, let's stop yapping. Let's stop waffle. Let's jump right into the gameplay. Okay. Damn it. I cursed. Fuck. Now I got to edit it out. Okay. New game. Let's turn off the lights. Creepy Waves FM. Oh, it must be like, maybe there's multiple games. Oh, dude. If, there's, if, this, if these people made multiple games, I'm going to have to check it out. Because this seems scary. I've only heard good things. This story, it's not something I tell often. Honestly, I wasn't sure if I ever would. It was during one of those hot, stifling summers. The kind where the air feels heavy. And time seems too slow. Wait, <laughs> they used the wrong two. It fucked me up. It fucked me up. I was 16, and for the first time... I was traveling alone. My parents had gone ahead to our family gathering by plane. Me? <laughs> I was taking the train to meet them. You know, there's something about being alone on a journey that makes you feel more grown up than you are. Do you guys like the haha -ha I added? Did the ha ha make it? Ahem. <coughs> <coughs> I had my backpack, my phone, and laptop. Felt like an adventure waiting to happen. When the train started moving, I felt a mix of excitement and a little bit of worry. But I had no idea what was really ahead. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of scared. I thought it was just going to be a straightforward ride. <coughs> oh my god, I have an itch in my throat. No, water! But it turns out, it wasn't a straightforward ride at all. Oh. A text message from Trainjet. Is that my, f is that the train station texting me? How do I check my phone? How do I check my phone? Hey bro, you have a text. You don't want to pull up your phone? I'm spamming every button. Bro does not want to pull up his phone. Fair enough. <coughs> oh, there we go. Oh, let's read them. Let's read our conversations with dad. Morning. Everything in order for your trip? Hey, dad. Yeah, just finishing up packing. Remember, organization is key and keep your phone charged. Charger's packed and I have a power bank. Good. On the train, stay alert, especially with your belongings. I understand. Keeping my luggage close. Also, a bit of reading wouldn't hurt. Balance out the screen time. I've packed a few books, actually. Glad to hear that. Stay sharp. Call us when you when you board. No delays. I will, straight after I find my seat. All right, travel safe. We're here if you need us. Looking forward to seeing you. Thanks, Dad. See you soon. Mom, we're headed to the airport now. Flight's at 1130. Blah, blah. Our ticket numbers. Got it. Your sister's excited to see you. Bought you a lot of presents from the trip. Tell Lenka. I've got surprises for her, too. Your father mentioned you haven't been answering. Sorry, was busy packing. I'll call him a moment. Okay. Okay, okay. That's a lot of yapping. That's a lot of yapping. All right, a lot of yapping. Train jet. Good day. Your connection TJ10064 will be delayed by approximately 15 minutes. The length of the delay may change. We apologize for the inconvenience. Good day. Your seat number is 36. Please take your des designated seat upon boarding the train. Thank you for choosing train jet. Is it here? Is it here? Seat number 36. They said it's going to take 15 minutes to get here. Well, while I wait, I guess we can actually double check what my mom said. She's just talking about... Yeah, we're flying off. Your father said you're not answering. If you're worried about planes, does that mean... Oh, we're scared of planes. Does that mean we should worry too? I'll call you when we land. We landed. You pack everything. Got them. Okay. All right. Can't wait to see you. Okay. So they said that my train number was train 10064. I thought I had to wait 15 minutes. That This is my train. My seat is seat 36. Hey, how we doing? Yeah, your kid is ugly. Why am I mean? Hey, hey, Buster! Move it, you old fart! 
Move. I'm talking to you, Gramps. Skedet. What? Um, may I please get past to my seat? Sorry, is seat 36 in this wagon? Do you know where I can find a toilet? May I please get past to my seat? Oh, absolutely. Your highness. Okay, I'm just, I just needed you to move for a second. No need for the sarcasm, little boy. Get the fuck out of the way. Is that my seat? Oh, don't mind me. I'll just stand out of the way until you're done. <laughs> oh, God. Bro is making a scene on the train. Sir. I'm gonna just sit down. You're fucking obnoxious, bro. Let me put my back up there. Not right now. Sometimes I imagine what it'd be like to travel the world like in the video game. Is that me talking? Am I talking to you? I was not trying to talk to you and your ugly kid. I was trying to get into my seat. Wait, can I talk to every passenger? I can't. Well, let me find seat 36. What? Do they have numbers on them? How do I find seat 36? Before sitting in my seat, I should stow... I should have stowed my backpack away. Well, do it. Oh, 36, it says up there. <laughs> you give me bad vibes, buddy. You give me bad vibes. I'm gonna sit my ass down on this seat. <laughs> Chill. Enjoy the time. Yo, are they playing patty cake? No. No, they're just clapping. Who are they clapping for? Uh, mom texted me. <laughs> Uh, have you left already? How's your seat? Everything okay? Yeah, we're on our way now. Found my seat alright, but, you know, some people here could definitely be nicer. <laughs> I'll text more once, we fur once we're further along. Just setting up my laptop for the journey. My laptop must have been in the backpack. Well, then let's grab it then, buckaroo. Oh, snacks! Towels! Books! La I'm prepared. We're gonna play some Dead by Daylight on the train, though. I should have placed my notebook on the table first. Wait. Your notebook on the table first? Oh! You wanna... I forgot. That's how those work. Table was small. The laptop was somehow fitting. Well... Let's play some good old DBD. Our favorite game. Twelve oh five a.m. Yo, that's late as hell. I bet Gramps gonna be feeling up my fucking left pectoral. He's gonna be grabbing my left titty. I'm gonna look back. Grandpa, stop! Vaklov? Who the hell is Vaklov? Vaklov Drakov! Who the heck is this? Yo, finished the history project yet? Uh, almost. Need to add some pictures. Cool, cool. Uh, I'm barely halfway through. Just don't use AI generated ones. <laughs> LOL. Sure thing. Actually, this doesn't sound like a bad idea. I heard they do it in some schools. Yeah, let check the link later. Man, you online? Arm wrestlers too? Sorry, man. Train Wi-Fi. Just needed to log in. Want to play the clicker before we arrive? Am I going to play with him? I'm playing arm wrestlers too. No, no, no. Sit back down. I want to play arm wrestlers too. What the fuck? I want... Yeah, I want to play arm wrestlers... I got a cat wop. Is this a kit clicking game? Oh. I love little cookie cutter games like this. Like little cookie cutter cookie simulation tap cookie clicker cookie clicker clicker games. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Hold on, let me. Sorry. What can I get you? Croissant plate. And lemon soda, burger with fries and mint soda, Japanese style cake and strawberry. Give me the croissant plate and lemon soda. That sounds delish. I am afraid we don't have any soda. I can get you some water with the meal. Sure. Yeah, I'm not going to be difficult. Listen, it's not your fault, right? <laughs> I will bring your order a little bit later. Okay. Train was quite modern, and it was strange that they only had water today. I didn't get to read the rest, but I'm playing my cookie. Ugh! Ugh! Okay, let's get some upgrades. Threadball, level up. Cat mint, level up. Cardboard fort. Card cardboard fort. I need the cardboard fort. Hold on. There we go. Oh! What does that do for I I have so many lazy cats! Laser pointer? Oh, laser pointer is 1,400 coins. I gotta get it. Hold on. 
I know we gotta continue with the game, but one time, me and my friend went to Disneyland. This is not a this is not a false story. Me and my friend went to Disneyland. Me and my friend Sebastian. And we literally played a cookie cutter game like this the entire time. Two grown dudes at Disneyland together on their iPhones on the Haunted Mansion, just fucking clicking on their screen trying to see who could get the who could get the fastest upgrade first. We sat th all day. That's all we played. We didn't look up from any of the rides. We just went home after. Two grown ass men going to Disneyland together. <laughs> Yeah, people thought we were dating, and what? And I kissed them when they when they wondered. And then he'd be like, please stop kissing me, and I'd be like, what the fuck, dude? Okay, okay, enough of the cat game. Should I check my phone or something, or are we... Hey, lady. Hey, lady, where's the... Where's the soda? You're taking a minute. Maybe I can go do something else. Oh, my cat game goes crazy. Ooh. There was this strange bag in the toilet. What is this? It was strange that someone left a bag full of uniform in the toilet? A full uniform? A bag full of full uniform? That is strange. Why would someone do something like that? Am I going to put it on? I hope that was number one. If it was number two, we got to go see a doctor. My food came back, so I returned to my seat. Damn, bro, you talk fast. I got to read that shit, dude. Give me a second. Fuck you. I am. Wait, where's my seat? Oh, shit. Okay. There we go. Is my food here? I'm ready to eat, ma'am. Ma'am? 12 21 p.m. Whoa, that's a whole 12 hours later. Mom texted me, and I got my croissant. Oh, sorry. Couldn't resist. That's not what I ordered. That's not what I ordered. Looks great. It's okay. In those trains, they make better quality food. Is it tasty? Uh, yeah. Shame they had no soda. Good. Okay. Well, let's... Three whole ass croissants? Oh my god, that's a lot of... I am sorry. You are the gentleman wanted the soda? We have found a pack in our storage. Enjoy, please. Fortunately, they had a few more. That's a service. I don't trust that, actually. I don't really want to drink that soda. I need to drink something before I ate anymore. Water? No, you want to drink the... You want to drink the open soda that he... The open soda? He didn't have to open it. But he did. I was so thirsty that I drank all soda in a single gulp. Back to the croissants. It was warm and had this strange taste. Oh my god, bro, just drank the fucking captain's piss. But I was happy and hoped it wasn't lying there for years. Man, some people are just not, just don't have that sense of danger, huh? It's like survival of the fittest. This guy just, that, this guy's fight or flight is just broken. Uh, what am I gonna do? Soda can was empty, you wanna get up now? Do you have to pee? After meal, I wanted to spend some time on the walk. Or I could just play laptop. Well, come on. Which one are we really gonna do? I'd rather just play laptop. Yes! I have three, 33,000 lazy cats. Get me a petting machine. I fell asleep. I fell asleep, bro, we have work to do. Don't fall asleep, don't fall asleep. Come on, hold on. Give me the petting machine. And then a Christmas tree. Hey, stop, bro, we're still playing. Don't fall asleep, no. Fight the, fight the laziness. Fight the sleepiness. We have more things to unlock. We have to get a plaid. Whatever the oh. fuck. The Lost cause. Lost, he's not a real gamer. If he's not going to stay up. Suddenly, I felt a strong drowsy. Oh. I hope it doesn't have to do with the drink I just drank. To be honest, I always had one after a good meal. But that one was more persistent. Okay, but we could still leave it up to chance. And it was as if I could not resist it at all. Okay. What you doing, bro? What are you up to, big dog? 16.08 p.m. Whoa. They got way more hours than us in this world. What the heck? Whoa, 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 whoa. I gotta check out my fucking lazy cat score more than anything. 
There we go. Okay. Sorry, had to buy had to buy a bunch of cats. Okay, anyways, something more important is, is happening. I was asleep for a long. For a long, and this man in my dream. We must have already reached the border station. What the fuck? I need to take a little walk and get some fresh air in the lobby. Yeah. Where's the lobby? Everyone's asleep. How are you doing, by the way? What now? You don't see I'm busy here. My bad. My bad. I'm gonna go chill in the lobby? I wasn't planning to go there for now. Where's the lobby? What is a lobby? In general. Who are you? Are you the police? ID and tickets. Please. Traveling alone? Yes, my parents are waiting for me at the destination. Hmm. Luggage contents? Any prohibited items? Just my clothes, some books, and snacks. Huh. Always ready, son. Guess additional search isn't necessary. I know, my parents told me to. Alright, move along. What a weird guy. Border control officer seemed to be quite tense, but finally decided to leave me alone. Yeah, he's a fucking weirdo. Oh shit, did he get hit by a train? Oh no, that was just us leaving. Train started leaving to the station just after he left. Oh, okay. Good, 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 good. Good, good, good. That could have got. That could have got bad. I thought bro got smacked by a train and would you like to order anything else i see those wine bottles pull pour me a glass of your sweetest uh chardonnay is that wine sorry wait did i just ask for another soda i didn't even read the option sorry i told you before we have no soda unfortunately we had an unexpected shipment delay but your colleague said you found la the last pack second steward Sorry, I work alone on today's shift. You saw a loose uniform in the bathroom, and you took an open soda from a strange man. Oh my god. Do you feel okay? You don't look well. I, I, I'm fine, I guess. You are probably tired. We will arrive soon. Please call me if you need anything. At least you're such a sweetheart. I appreciate you. I'm gonna go back to my, my pussy clicking. Oh my god, I got 789,000 lazy cats! Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Wait, I reached maximum. I reached the maximum almost. I'm too strong. I'm too powerful. I have too many cl clickeroonies. Look at this shit. Oh my god. Oh, sorry, sorry. I gotta. Should I get up? Am I okay? Ma'am! Ma'am, what is this? I don't want to go! Hey, you're big as fuck. Get over here. You look like you're about 6'4". Come here. I wasn't planning to go there for now. Oh, you are smart now. You are smart now. I like it, dude. I like it. We're using our brain. Hey, someone left their backpack. I like it, dude. We're using our brain. Oh, yes! You want to just go back and play games? I'm fucking down, dude. Should we talk to everybody? Years in my line of work have sharpened my observation skills. It's curious what secrets people carry on their travels often hidden in plain sight. I enjoy observing people on the train. You can see all sorts. Just last year I saw someone who looked like they were up to no good. You tell them, Grandma. <laughs> Ever get the feeling someone's not what they seem? I, I tell my son, keep an eye out. Spot the odd ones. It's a strange world. Okay. I haven't talked to the big boy over here. Why would someone make three pages long booklet? Okay. Well, doesn't seem like anyone has anything to say, so I'm going to go back down on my laptop and chill. Unless I was supposed to look at my phone, maybe. No new text. Nothing from Vlakov Jorkov. The man that was in my dreams. Oh. What about him? Was looking for something in my baggage. Sh oh. What? 
What did bro drop off? What did bro drop off? Oh my god, he left a bag of shit inside of my bag. Bro, you cannot just be dropping deuces wherever you want. For some reason, I thought it'd be better to check what's inside in the toilet where no one will see me. Well, that's probably where what is in the bag should have went anyways, so. Am I gonna get jump scared right now? Is someone in there? No. Okay, good. All right. What's in the bag? What's in the... Cocaina! I wasn't sure, but this thing looked like drugs. Yeah, that's drugs, bro. That's drugs. Throw that shit in the toilet. Or is it a bomb? Is it a bomb? What you want to do with it, bro? It wouldn't be a good idea to go out with this thing in my hands. Maybe... Here, I got it. Huh. It ain't mine. Ah! Hi. Hi there, little boy. What did you do with my little presents? What did I do? Sorry. Yeah, the present. I'm traveling with it to my old friend. Did you tell something to the police about it? No, no, I, I wouldn't. Now listen to me very carefully. If you want to be safe, you're coming with me and sit on your seat until the last station. And remember, last thing you do. And remember, last thing. You do something funny and it will end up badly for you and your papa and mama. Come on, go forward. Not my papa and mama. Forward. Forward. What? It was locked. It was locked. Did I lose? Oh, I lost. I died. I died. Okay. Oh, I died. What if I throw this bag out the fucking train? What if I plant it on someone else? Okay, sorry, ma'am. Okay, I can't die. I wasn't supposed to go to the door that's locked. Why did I listen to his bitch ass? Why did I listen to his bitch ass? Okay. Okay. Hey there, little boy. What'd you do with my little present? Okay, okay, I'm gonna... Open it now, or you know what will be after. What will be after? He was able to break this door. I must be- I must be doing something? I said open it! I just need what's in the bag! I flushed it! You did what?! I will bury you alive under this train! Open this goddamn door now, I said! Come in, bitch! Come in! Come in, I'm throwing this thing at your dome. Come in, my boy. I dare you. Oh, wait, maybe I... Ah! Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. I'm flushing this shit. Can I flush it? Can I flush it? I can't. I said open it. No, I flushed it. Fuck you. I'm about to fucking throw this shit at, at his forehead, bro. I'm gonna give this guy the biggest egg on his head, bro. I'm gonna throw this shit so hard as fucking for Come in, my dude! Come in! Yeah, I'm ready! I'm ready. No one- Fuck you! I'm aiming high as fuck! Fuck you! This game sucks. Okay. You come into my home and you make a fool out of me and my family. You come into my home, I let you, I let you eat. I let you sleep with my wife. I let you eat my food. And this is how you repay me.
Thank you for traveling with Trainjet. This is a train board service. Are you okay? We had an emergency call from this toilet. The toilet called? Please open the door. I'm not opening. The toilet is so real. Thank you, buddy. You saved me. A few years have passed since the ins since this incident. My parents had meetings with the police, but in the end, everything turned out all right. Our family was provided with protection and even received a certificate from the city. And little by little, memories of what of it of that event have faded but since that day i have started traveling by plane and then the sequel is him the plane crashing and then he dies because that's the reason he didn't want to get on a plane to begin with okay i like that game that was cool different story a jump scare or two here and there funny dialogue i liked it that was cool beautiful okay so this is the second game we're going to be playing the earl street massacre uh it's a game about a dude named earl and probably some massacres happen on his on his street or something like that. Finally, uh, I can't believe I'm actually home. Those guys are the worst. <laughs> they dropped all that work on me out of nowhere. I really thought I'd have to stay overnight again. Oh, this is the game where I'm a dude who worked my ass off at work, fucking over over worked overtime, came home. I don't know if everything's gonna be the way I think it'll be. Whatever. Uh, I'm too tired. I guess I'll take a shower. Maybe I'll watch a movie after. I guess I'll take a shower and I'll watch a movie after. Sounds like a good day to me. Work hard. Work hard, then play even harder. Okay, well. Where's the restroom, bro? Oh. Oh. Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm never going in there. I'm never going in there. I'm never going. What is that? Well, not going to get cleaned in there. <laughs> Master bedroom. That's where I clap my wife's cheeks. My son's bedroom. That's where he accidentally oh, hears me clap my wife's cheeks. Is that why I'm not seeing this shit? Okay. That's my stepson. I have to take care of I have to take care of that boy. It's his, it's his uh it's my wife's son. Bro's always getting in the way. I'm just trying to enjoy his mother. And he's always knocking on the door. Mom, I threw up. Like, come on, son. Can only virgin see this stuff? I'm so tired. Is that why I'm not seeing this They shit? really didn't let me take a break today. My clothes are a mess, too. Uh, I should throw them in the washing machine first. Okay, bro, so why didn't you say that? Because now you got me wandering around the house. Why didn't you say that, buckaroonie? Ah, uh, you're lucky. You're lucky the layout of the house is efficient. We leave the laundry machine by the shower. I like that. I like the way that we were thinking. Ah, ha, ha, ha. There we go. Nothing like a nice warm shower. I'm gonna put the shower head on my pussy. Wait, wait. Hmm, I wonder where Anna is. She's usually home by now. Maybe her bus is running late. I should try calling her later. Yeah. Yeah, let's just finish with the shower, bro. And leave your pussy alone. No pussage. I'm starting to get a bit hungry. I haven't eaten anything since breakfast. Bro, what are you doing? There should be some leftovers in the fridge I can eat. Oh, he's so excited about that. I can't wait to finally just crash on the couch. Yeah, I know, bro. You seem like you keep talking about the things you want to do. Just do them. He's just trying to narrate for me. I get it. If he didn't say it, I'd be getting more upset because I'd be like, what the fuck am I supposed to do? And even though he said it, I still forgot. What did he say? Oh, my God. Damn, son. Do I have to warm it up? I was just gonna eat my left. I was gonna just eat my leftovers cold. If I'm being real with you, I was just chilling. But I guess we'll warm it up. Why not? Turn the TV on. Relax. I was gonna put the. I was just gonna fucking start eating, munching on that shit while it was still cold. I didn't care. Okay. Oh my god, the junk drawer. Oh, nice and warm. Now, do I eat on the table? Like a person with manners, or do I enjoy my life and eat on the couch while watching TV? Because maybe I'm a G. Maybe I'm a G. Am I a G? I'm a G. I don't have, bro. What's up with that? I would just want to stare at a, 
The cat. Oh, my favorite show is on today. It's a shame Anna's not. Anna, Anna, Anna. Anna's not home yet. Oh, this is my favorite show. My wife calls me. What are you, what are you watching? Just a bunch of puss. Just a bunch of puss on my screen. Oh, hum, 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 hum. Eat, bro. Scarf it down. Damn, you're taking a while. Okay, well, this is my favorite show. Let's keep watching. Cat. Cat. Cat un laying in grass. Cat un, la cat un on wooden fence. Mmm. That was the season finale of season three. That shit was deep. Cat un field of grass. Oh. Well, that was yummy. Huh? Someone's at the front door, and they are ringing that shit up. I wonder who it is this late. Mm, who the frick is it? I lost my ability to growl. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Got it back. Hello. Did I scare them off? If I heard someone as cool as manly as me, I'd be scared too. Damn it, stupid kids ding dong ditching at this hour. I can't believe I had to get up for this. I really hope I haven't missed anything. What happened to my anime voice? Now I'm turning almost into a southern guy. What the hell? You've got to be kidding me. Did the Wahing machine trip the breaker again? Not the Wahing machine! Uh, it's so dark! There should be a flashlight in the kitchen. I really hope the batteries are still good. Ah, fucking Wahing machine always breaking on me and shit. Said there's a flashlight in the kitchen? I know where the junk drawer is! And I bet it's in the drunk door. The drunk door? The junk drawer. Dunk door! There you are. Let's see if you still work. Ugh, I hate going down into that stupid basement. Yeah, we're going into the basement. I figured, as soon as I saw that fucking basement, I knew. I've always found it so creepy for some reason. For some reason? Well, I can... I Listen, buddy, I can give you a lot of reasons. Uh, reason number one. Uh, you can't see the bottom. You can't see the bottom. Uh, reason number two. It's dark. Reason number three. It's so deep. Wait, it's not as dark anymore. It was looking so creepy before. This is fine. I'm not that scared. Hey, where are my wife and, and, and kids, by the way? Where am I going? Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm scared. Oh my god, I'm scared. Where am I going? Where are my wife and kids? There's someone in that fucking closet. No, my God, Anna. No, 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 no. This can't be happening. <laughs> She's dead. I, I have to get help now. Oh, you sussy baka. Sussy baka. Sussy baka. Okay, that gave me an itch in my throat. <laughs> Yo, Lizzie Chicken Burger, thanks for the 24 months, dude. I appreciate you. I know I'm not around much, but I love you and I hope you're well. And you're you're getting you're gonna always get your stuff from me. I mean, bro, 24 months. Oh my god, and you're not around much. I appreciate you. If you're not around much, then you don't gotta you gotta do that, bro. I appreciate you. Thank you, thank you for the 24, Lizzie. I hope everything's been good, dude. Brianna, thank you, Brianna, Brianna. Thanks for the hundred biddies. Okay, but there's a knife on the ground, so you should have expected to find a body. Was there a knife on the ground? I didn't see a knife on the ground. Let me go double check. Thanks for the hundred biddies, Brianna. I appreciate you, dude. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, two years is crazy, Lizzie. Thank you so much, dude. For real. Um. Uh. Oh, this knife on the ground? Okay, Detective Sherlock. I'm glad that you found out that there'd be a murder five seconds before it happened. What do you want, a medal? She's dead! She's dead, my, uh, my wife, uh, I'm feeling like such a baka. Yeah, I'm kind of scared, though, because, like, if my wife is dead, where's the kid, and how do I know he's not an accomplice? Huh! What the? Damn it. What the hell was that? 
I can't stay here. I need to hide somewhere. I'm not going there. Why? Anywhere. Fuck. Where am I supposed to even hide in here? I ain't, I don't know, in the table. In the table. Yeah, <laughs> under the table. No one ever checks under the table. It's like the least obvious hiding spot ever. I'm sure we'll be okay. Who the fuck is that? Is that the kid? There's no way he murdered his fucking mom. Who the fuck? Mm -hmm. Hello? Oh my god, what is he doing? What is he doing? What is he doing? Bro? There's no one here! It's just you, yourself, and you. Please. Just leave. Thank you, my friend. Towards the door. Get the fuck out. They should have made it so I look this way and boom, something pops up. That would make me queen. Wait. That's my chance. I'll just have to make a run for it. Ooh. 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 That's not running! Come on. Open, open, open. Shit. No, 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 no. Open already, goddammit. No. No. Oh, it's over. It's over. It's over. Just don't even look behind you. Just, just, just don't. Butthole fully puckered. What the fuck? Why are you so strong? Yo, bro is kind of burly. And he made me fall asleep. That's what happens when you work a 10 hour shift. I'm tired, bro. I was working hard. And you're gonna leave me alone? It's not even gonna kill me. Is that why I'm not seeing this shit? Oh my god, he's gonna fucking put his nutsack on my face. Not the. All right, everybody, the third game we're going to be playing is called Hibernation. I don't know, there's probably some bears sleeping in it or something, if I had to guess. Something along those lines. Um, I don't think that's actually what it's about. Do you know who killed me? $20,000 reward. Call local department with evidence. Oh, wow, this is a... Oh my god, why are we starting the game off with the scariest vibes ever? This is the worst thing ever. I got chills! I got goose- I got in goose and pimples. I feel like people that say goose pimples have to be like Swedish or something. I got in goose and pimples. Oh my god, you're scaring me. I always hate coming back to this town. But I want that money! <laughs> I get you, my guy! Secure that motherfucking bag! Oh. I guess I need to find some evidence about her case if I want them to cough up that cash. Oh, I'm a detective. Uh, but I'm a very lucrative detective. Listen, I'm not here because uh, I'm Superman. I'm not here to fight crime. I'm here to get that bag. And I just happen to be a smart motherfucker. Uh, battery. Well, let's go talk to some people. Knock. Oh, I'm a detective. That's what this game's about. Open the fucking door. Hello? Hello, open the door. I need to have a word. Ma'am. All right. Nobody's home. They're lucky I'm not with the police. I'm a private investigator. I don't have any... I don't have any power. I can't make them open the door. Hello? I said hello. All right. You know... Looks like it's chained shut. If I want to investigate, I'll need some bolt cutters that scared the fuck out of me. Don't fucking knock back. Okay. 
I'm not investigating him. Uh, fuck that shit. There's a creepy ass ch Okay. I did take a couple ben Benny drillies. I took a couple Benny drillies before I before I got here. I can't complain. I've had a couple conversations with the Hat Man already, so this isn't anything new. What's in this? Locked, but I bet I could find the key in the prices home. Well, I. Ma'am, I have bolt cutters, and I and I will bolt cut your nipples off if you fucking attack me. I swear to God, I'm not scared to use these bolt cutters. If you think your nipples are stronger than these bolts, you're wrong. All right, well, we open the gate. I'm not actually a fan of knocking anymore. I think I'm just going to enter. Oh, shit, actually. I'm not, I'm not knocking no more. Yo, there's been a lot. There's been a cat in every game we play today. I'm just going to call this three scary games about cats. And then people are going to join in on the YouTube video. They're going to be like, oh, my God, I want to see three scary cat games. They're going to be disappointed. But will they? Interact. Evidence collected. They be drinking. They be drinking. Picture one. There are multiple beer bottles scattered around the house. I can use this to say the Price family were heavy drinkers. Drinker? I hardly... Perhaps this influenced the tension between the Price parents and their daughter. Maybe. What the fuck is that? Lucy has been spouting nonsense again. Something about wanting to leave town for good. How dare she? We've been here our whole lives, and she's just gonna throw her history in our church away? Yeah, they're a cult. This whole town is a cult. Maybe sending her there more often will help. There must be a way to convince her to stay. <sighs> creepy, creepy, creepy guys, creepy guys, acting a little weird and creepy. Uh-oh. What is that behind you? Oh my god! I hate what is that behind you jump scares. I hate them and they never actually do it. They actually, they always pretend. They say, what is that behind you? And there's nothing there. Oh, I hate what is that behind you jump scares. Interact. Interact. Take a picture of the, of the Bible. Take a picture of the Holy Bible. There are multiple religious books around the house. I can use this to say religion was a factor, as the Price family frequented the nearby church. Perhaps religion influenced the Price family to murder their daughter. Ooh. Perhaps. I like what we're thinking. What the fuck? I like the way we're I like the way we're thinking. You look like a gooner. You look like an edger. I can tell bro be gooning and edging. Why do I feel so short right now? I feel tiny. Was I this short all this time? I guess I was. Bros goonin', bros edgin', bros looks look maxin'. Lucy Price, our dear daughter? Oh, they buried her. Oh, because we're trying to find out who killed her. Yeah, they know she's dead, but they have something to do with it. There is a lone grave sitting in the backyard. I can use this to say they buried their daughter out of guilt for what they've done. I know there's no body here, but nobody else needs to know that. Oh, there's levels to this shit. Uh, okay, what now? Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Is he okay? Oh, he's probably just drunk. He's probably just drunk, right? Corpse! Oh! The body of Mr. Price is in the backyard. It looks like he overdosed on pills. I can use this to say that he couldn't handle the guilt from murdering his daughter and took his own life. Shameful. Damn. Shameful. Lucy is gone. Our daughter is gone. The police say she is missing. But we both know she isn't coming home. She's gone. Our church said they could convince her. And now look what fucking happened. I threw the key to the place into the neighbor's trash out of anger. I don't think God can help us anymore. We failed. A key 
in the neighbor's trash. Oh my god, look at that gravestone. It even goes through the fucking... That's crazy. That must have been an expensive-ass fucking headpiece. What are those things called? Um, uh, well... I gotta go into the trash can of my neighbors. Can I get out of this house without fucking dying? Is the cat okay? No. Bro's still good. Bro's still good. Oh! The key must be in the trash still. Yeah! I hope it's not the fucking neighbors that knocked back at us. They scared me. Which house? <gasps> I see the trash. It's not them. Thank God. It's different neighbors. Hello? Church key! I'm a beast. I thought that'd be like finding a, a needle in a haystack. We found that shit right away. Okay, well, we got the church key. Let's go find out what went on with Lucy, because that $20,000 reward is looking, looking pretty nice. Looking pretty nice. You know what I'm going to do with the 20000 I think I'm going to spend it on 15000 big booty bitch. And just fill a room with big booty bitches and have them just bounce around every... <laughs> There'll be no sexual, anything sexual going, it's just them bouncing around the room. Sounds kind of fun, no? Uh, pick up key, another one. Is there a nightclub going to- is father getting crunk? In the church basement. Sounds like they're playing a Kid Cudi song down there. In a moment, in the twinkling of an eye, at the last trump, for the trumpet shall sound, and the dead shall be raised incorrup incorruptible, and we shall be changed. Our Lord will return. In doing so, he needs a vessel. Oh my god, they possess this little fucking girl. The local maiden will be appointed for hibernation. It's not about, about a bunch of bears sleeping. No! Awaiting his return in the bowels of our church? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, in the bowels? How do I get to the bowels of the church? Hey, bro? Oh. How do we get to the bowels of the church? Do you know where that is? Oh my god. Tasting the rain tasting a little metally. Tasting a bit metallic. Last time I tasted this much blood, it was my girlfriend's time. Drop the base. Hey, I found the basement where the Kid Cudi music's going on. Hello. Evidence collected. Five of four. I'm an overachiever. I've collected too much evidence. I think I will find out too much, too many people that that killed this girl. I am the detective. All I need is a large trench coat and a cigarette. And the rain. It's already raining. Yeah, blood is fine. Why did it get quiet? Why did it get quiet? Oh, fuck me! Oh my god, what the- What did you just- Oh my god, Lucy Price! Lucy Price is dead. I did the deed myself. I did the right thing. What do you mean you did the deed yourself? The day of rapture will follow soon. Only through her hibernation will our Lord Only through our hibernation will our Lord will return to us. He will stand above this town as the trumpets screech their songs. I did the right thing. Her face! Oh my god! She looking like 
Lucy Prise, for he is king. Relax. You're scaring the children. Me. You're scaring me. I tried to blame it on the children you're scaring. 20,000. Wait. Does bro like make people go missing in his church and then and then solve the case for his own money? What's happening? Case conclusion. After, that's a lot of money. After a local detective investigated the Price family home, they discovered that after growing tensions arose in the family, Lucy Price was a was a, was murdered by her parents. It wasn't me. This detective had been paid a ten thousand dollar reward by Lucy's relatives for this unfortunate discovery. Yep. More on the story at six. Well. So, why did he say I did it? Is there a twist? Did I? Did I do the bad? Yeah, when video games use real pictures, that shit scares me. Well, that was the third game. I just found some games on Itch.io that I thought looked cool. Wanted to try them out, have some fun. If you guys liked them, let me know in the comments. Let me know which one was your favorite of the three. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.